Good morning, Wallhawks. It's Tuesday, February 4th, and who doesn't love pulling on a cozy sweater on a cold day? It's like getting a hug from the universe when you feel the weight and comfort as a sweater settles around you. Well, today is the day to get that hug, because today is Sweater Day. That's right. Beginning in the early 2000s, Sweater Day has been a great tool to get people thinking and talking about energy conservation. This holiday not only lets us show off the gifts we get from Granny, but lets us dig deeply into our closets. Remember, this isn't ugly Christmas sweater day, but sweater day. What's the difference? I'm glad you asked. While ugly Christmas sweater day is a great time to get goofy, sweater day is about being serious. It reminds us that when we don our sweaters, we can turn the thermostat down. We can lower the amount of fuel that is needed to keep us toasty in the wintertime. Even the World Wildlife Fund supports this holiday as the earth and all the animals on it are heavily affected by the various uses of fuel. Did you know that if an entire nation just turned down the thermostat down by two degrees, it would be the same as taking over 700,000 cars off the road? So cozy up in that sweater today and save some energy too. Now let us warm you up with some announcements. Here are some upcoming dates that you need to know. Tomorrow is World Read Aloud Day and Thursday is the school dance. And Friday is a non-school day. What a great week. Next week is pretty good, too, because February 13th is the first day the book fair will be open during home base classes and parent-teacher conferences. And the new date for our school, our school Battle of the Books is Thursday, April 9th. That's awesome. We should also wish good luck to those students who will be participating in the DCSD Jazz Festival on February 24th. The door is open for the evening performance at 6 o'clock p.m. The performance begins at 6.30. Students are free, so we hope you can all get out there to support our band members. There will be a $5 donation for adults as a suggested donation. And here's an important, important rehearsal reminder for our 7th and 8th grade jazz musicians. You have an evening rehearsal tonight to prepare for the jazz festival. The rehearsal will be held in the Washington Band Room from 6 to 7.30 p.m. Please enter the building through the main doors facing Grand View. In other musical news, the crew list for VPA will be posted this Thursday, February 6th on the VPA board located across from the auditorium. Crews will begin meeting in late February. In sports news, the Washington White basketball teams will be playing Roosevelt Silver at 4 p.m. The 8th grade game will be, will be held at, at Roosevelt and the 7th graders play at Wash. The Senior Color Guard will be hosting its annual spring show and day camp on Sunday, February 16th from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m., with the show beginning at 3 p.m. You will join the award-winning Dubuque Senior Color Guard to learn a dance routine and perform it with the team at the show. Cost is $30, and registration forms can be found in the main office. Big happy birthday wishes go out to Haley Scott and Macy Connor today as they celebrate the, the day they were born. We hope all your birthday dreams come true. It's now time to wrap up with the thought for the day. Sweater weather is better weather. Wear your sweater today, Wash.